What's up guys, today I'm going to show you some good ways to make your channel look a little bit more professional. Okay, let's get started with your avatar. Your avatar is shown in the top left corner of your channel beside your title. It is not very important, but it does make your channel look a little bit more professional if you have a good avatar. The optimum pixel rate is at 800 by 800 square. You also want a cool background that goes along with the theme of your channel. If you have it marked as fixed instead of scrolling, then you won't have to worry about its size. If you, can, if you cannot find a good background, then you can make your background any solid color right here. They have quite a few choices and it is much better than leaving your background blank, you know. You, you also can customize your title, which a lot of people don't really know about. I would recommend keeping it pretty short though, because if it has too many letters, it will cut off the end and just go dot dot dot. And they won't be able to tell what it is you're saying. And that would not be good because you're trying to describe your channel and if they can't read it then yeah you also have a description and tags which you should use to tell people about your channel also along with having any links that you would want to be available to your viewers you also want to choose your default tab that's the tab where people start when they visit your channel I like the feature tab because it is where I put my best video displayed prominently and it gives potential subscribers some of my better work to look at then you need to choose what kind of layout your channel should have there are three choices overview blogger and everything overview just shows basically everything you've done recently blogger shows your video starting with most recent at the top and working down that's obviously good for someone who puts a lot of videos up and wants people to be able to see his last dozen or so and my favorite which is everything that's great because you get to choose any feature video instead of your most recent video which allows you to put your best work out there for people to see it is also very good at advertising a feature playlist or one of your channels. Then you decide what you want your feed to share. I have it set for just uploading videos and adding videos to playlists, which are automatic, because I don't think my viewers care when I like something or leave a comment on some video. If you have any product you want to sell, then you can enable the store tab. I don't, so I don't use it and don't know very much about it. You can also add channels you want to feature right here or add playlists over here. That's pretty simple, and that's about everything. If you do all this, then you will be on your way to making your channel look good. Thanks so much for watching this, and if you want to learn more about everything there is, once a week, make sure you hit the subscribe button. Hard.